So I wanted to show you guys something here, a little bit of how I uh, planned this piece. So, um, okay, I was reading this National Geographic, and when I saw this castle, I thought, I have to draw it. But what I, you know, there were a few things I didn't really like. There were things I really liked and the things that I thought I could do without. Um, one was I took away anything modern. I took away telephone poles and paved roads and that modern house there. Um, and I didn't like the sky too much, so I knew I was going to do something different with that. Uh, so that was the first thing. And then for inspiration, I went into this uh, Rembrandt book of drawings. Now, when you are looking to get inspiration from a master, sometimes it's a little less intimidating to look at the drawings because they're still, you know, really good, but you can you can see some of their process a little clearer than from, you know, like from the uh, finished uh, paintings. So I looked at a few of these landscapes, and uh, I looked at how he kind of approached the, you know, the shadows and some of the articulation, just to get a little, a little, uh, you know, inspiration. Didn't dwell too long on it either. And then, you know, after that, after about a month, I that National Geographic portrait became this. And so as you can see, it's like a lot older and the sky is a lot different. Uh, this area over here was a little, little steeper than in the picture and I left it because it has a very nice quality to the uh, overall composition. It has kind of a nice bit of drama there which I thought that the, um, you know, the picture might have been lacking a little bit. So that's basically how I did it. Just a little note into how I, how I do things in case anybody is uh, interested. And, you know, when you look at masters, you just have to understand that that's, that they are a master. You can just get a piece of what they do and use it for inspiration. And with enough practice, there's no reason you can't get there yourself as well. Uh, that's it, guys. Hope you're having a great day. Talk to you guys later. Bye-bye.